Franchise Report. Reporting live. Yes, sir. Franchise in the building. Franchise important effect. As it goes down another mother effing day. Lovely Leticia in the building. And back to grace us with his presence. Lipsy, what up, family? What up, what up, what up? How you doing today, bro? Another day. Another day just trying to get it as usual. How's everything with you? Uh, Same shit, different day. Just kind of di- decided to do a whole bunch of life quests since the last time I've been here. What do you mean? Like trying new like, different things? Uh, You know, I uh, had a baby. Oh, congratulations. That is a life, that's a life quest yeah. right there for you. That's a whole different journey that I wasn't even expecting. How old is the baby now? Uh, Nine months right now. Okay. Oh, I, I'm about to be nine months in okay. a couple of days. Okay. Congratulations. Thank Congrats. you. Thank you. Welcome. What else have you been doing? Bungee jumping and stuff like that? <laughs> no, what honestly. Life quest, so I'm thinking. So I've... Decided to make it of my life's quest to focus on getting the artists paid rather than these pay to play shows and all these other shows that, you know, what's the return on investment? You know what I mean? I want these. I'm trying to get these artists paid to actually, you know, perform. Getting artists that, to help you and support you shouldn't be hard for, for something like right. that. Like you are exactly you're doing it for a full cause. You, yeah. you 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 were on the same wave the last time though, I believe. Trying I was. to get yeah yeah yeah. So now you're just making it. Your now I'm by myself. I'm by myself it. doing it. And, well, actually, no. You know, realistically, I do have a couple other people that I'm working with. I have a show coming up uh, in September, okay. September 13th. Uh, I'm the headliner, but I have uh, two artists that are opening for me: uh, G Miz and Tragic Montalvo. And uh, both of them are getting paid to perform. They're both getting a 30 minute set, not no 10 minute bullshit. You know what I mean? Like they're actually getting, you know, they're getting a decent chunk of change, triple digit. And they're also getting 30 minutes to perform. Wow. Now let me ask you, when you're, when you're paying these artists to perform, does what it, does it come with the, in return, I at least need you to promote out? <laughs> Well, 50% yeah. of like, come on, family. Well, yeah, 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 We're obviously. Can you at least help us with the promotion? And so yeah. does that? All right. Yeah. So, uh, you know, everybody's been, you know, making posts and whatnot, sharing and whatnot. We have the uh, Third Eye Open coming up uh, coming up this weekend. Okay. And all three uh, all three of us, me and uh, Tragic and uh, Jima's, all three of us are meeting up at the Open, and we're going to be handing out flyers, like actual, you know, groundwork. You know, That's what's up. Boot, okay. That's what's boots up. to the ground, trying to pass out flyers, get the word out, trying to get people in the door. I don't know about that style right there, Mr. 30-year-old. We used to pass out flyers, put them on people's doors or the cars. And, <laughs> Dude, and on my way to, because I walk to work, so every day on my way to work, I've been sta- I have a staple gun in my backpack, and I have flyers with me. I've been stapling the them to the telephone stuff, yeah. poles and shit on the way to work. Yup, we do that. <laughs> we do that now, and, the, and there's a QR oh, Sorry I didn't mean no, to go ahead, go ahead, I was going to say And there's a QR code right there That brings you to the Eventbrite page This way here You can buy the ticket right there There's no tickets at the door It's all it's all online tickets Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha So you're the opening I mean you're the main act, right? Yeah, I'm the headliner So do you think that 30 minutes is 30 minutes isn't too long? <laughs> no, why? No? The, the, there's been too many shows Where there's You know 10 minutes or even 15 minutes I feel like depending on the song length I feel like depending on la- that artist like hey they might need to take a breath real quick you know what I mean and this also gives them a chance to really show their catalog really show their versatility as an artist and really be able to be like hey you know instead of just three songs this is what I can really offer to the table and okay. you're not ru- you're not rushed exactly. you're not rushed. rushed but I mean I would say if you if no one knows you that's really... in the audience Ugh, they've been up there for a while no, <laughs> yeah, yeah 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 <laughs> no that would be me if I don't know the, I don't, if I don't know the person I, four songs is good enough for me so, I mean four songs is what that's 20 minutes right depending uh, on how the length of the song five minutes each song right uh, roughly yeah so I, I, I for me it would be like damn again so I, maybe that's just me. Maybe that's just me. Let me just shut up and mind my business. I don't know nothing. Well, well, no, well, no. At the same time, it's also on the person that's actually performing to keep you engaged. Yes, that too. Yes. Now, the plus side is if you do feel like, hey, you know what? I'm bored of this artist. We are going to have uh, a vendor out in the back over by the Tiki Bar. Uh, they're named the Budsman. Okay. And I think you can figure out what's going to be. I, mean, I, I just I can't say so. too. I, I can't so. say too, too much on the air, but I think you can, no, you go, out. You can say what it is. You can say what it is. Think about it. We smoking on camera. Right. So. I mean, that's fair, but I don't. I don't want to blow up. I don't. It, it's it's good, more good. like I private you, events. You, so. As I have this dear shirt on. Yeah. Say no to drugs. Well, like private oh, events. So I don't <laughs> want to blow up this spot. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. Um, other than that, like it's gonna be a great time. You know, if anybody's interested, you know, come on down, or at, you know, obviously, grab a ticket online. Easy enough. Okay. Easy enough. Okay. Easy enough. Okay. Um, Wait, um, did you say where the show was? Oh shit! I didn't even say that. I, we've smoked so much already. 
Well, because he made it seem like it was private, like he couldn't. So. Oh no, 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 my fault. Uh, it's in uh, New Bedford. It's in the South End, uh, ninety David, ninety David Street. Um, like I said, get a ticket online first, because if you just show up and try and buy a ticket at the door, there ain't gonna be no tickets at the door. Name of the venue? Uh, the Washington Club. The Washington nicknamed Club. Nicknamed the Woo. Okay. Woo. Hey, Woo. In the so. new. <laughs> yeah. Bedford area. Woo in the new. So. Well, real quick, let me just ask you one real fast. How's the music life been? How's the music life? Yep. So uh, I actually been working on I want to I think it's my seventh album. Okay. Okay. Um, I uh been doing little remixes here and there. I just did one over uh the first person shooter from uh, Drake and J Cole. Mm -hmm. I did one over uh the Rock Wilder from uh, Method Man and Red Man. Okay. And then I uh just recently did one over that song uh, Nasty from Tinashe. Mm. Um, funny enough. Uh, the second I put it up on uh, SoundCloud, because that's where I just put the remixes. Just mm -hmm, obviously, I don't mm -hmm, have the rights to the beats. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So uh, that shit got taken down faster than a speeding bullet. Mm -hmm. I had my oh finger God. ready to hit the button. So yeah. As soon as you guys are like, oh yeah, yeah, taking it down. We Insane. just talked about this. We just talked about this. And it's funny, too, because she just put up a thing that was like, yo, if you, you know, all these people like remix, you know, remix the track. I want to hear all these different remixes from all these different people. Maybe we can get like a, you know, an EP going of all the remixes. Mm -hmm. I've just fucking put out a remix. What the fuck's up? What's wrong with my shit? Okay. I see there's other ones up, 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 up online posted. Oh, there are. Yeah. Sometimes okay. you gotta reword it a certain way and things like that. It's, it's tricky now. It's getting really tricky now. It's fucked up. Really tricky, Emily. Um, alrighty. You was here what? Maybe two years ago. Two years ago. Yeah. Two years ago? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, yeah. So I, I never really got to ask you this question. Um, I need your top five. Dead or alive? Nope. Dead. Uh, so Biggie, Pac. Big L, Big Pun, and DMX. There you go. She got them all. Congratulations. Off the table. Off the table. No, oh, that's easy. To get that? Shut up, that's easy. That's easy. So, uh, for me, my top five would be uh, Lil Wayne. It's going to be Mac Miller. We're going to have uh, Suicide Boys. Um... Just for shits and giggles, I'm gonna throw Naughty by Nature in there. Wait, wait, Thank no, you, no, family. no, Thank no, you, hold on. Thank I'm gonna you, ask family. you your top five no, groups. Oh. I'm gonna ask you top right, five we'll groups. So oh, okay, take okay. Naughty okay. by Nature out. Do Suicide Boys count as a group? They're a duo. They're a duo. They're a duo. So yeah, no, they count as a group. Fuck. All right. Damn. So, no, you gotta come, you gotta bring it back. So who do you got? Lil Wayne. I got Lil Wayne. Mac I got Miller. Mac Miller. Uh, you know what? Uh, Cal Scrubby. Okay. Um. Kumo D. Okay. Classic. And last but not least, this is tough. I listen to so much hip, different hip hop. It's really kind of, honestly kind of tough. Uh, I'll throw. You tried to touch every single aspect of it. Backpack. Yeah, you, you tried to touch underground. You touched mainstream. What are, you trying, are you trying to touch a different genre of hip hop, or are you really just looking for your favorite? Honestly, just kind of really looking for my favorite at the moment. I'd say uh, we'll do Ramirez. Wow. Okay. All right. So now I need to know your top five groups. All right, so top five groups. We obviously got Suicide Boys in there. Right. Okay. Uh, we have uh, Outkast, uh, Naughty by Nature. Okay. 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 Um, they're not a named duo, but can I say Method Man and Red Man? Mm mm. Mm mm. Okay. I'll respect that. <laughs> and I have I have a gripe with that. I don't think Method Man and Red Man are a group. I don't think Kanye and Jay Z are a group. Okay, that's fair. I don't fair. think Drake and Twenty One Savage is a group. Oh, no. I never thought Drake and Future was a group. That's fair. That, that's not Onyx. That's not the Locks. That's not. Yeah. Okay. okay. Well, then I'll keep. I'll still keep. Method. Can we start, can we start a, a brand new category say, called Two Friends That Started Rapping Together? And we you want to do that? You want to add that as a third? We, okay. we don't have to start doing it. Okay. We don't have to start doing it. Damn it. Mob Deep is a group, man. We, Mob, we, yeah, we, yeah, Mob, we don't yeah. have to start doing it. started off as a group. So then, uh, name your top five two boys that smoke and started rapping together. I'll do the Wayne and Joel. So I'll keep. I'll keep Method Man at least, and I'll say Wu Tang. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. You got that. What's that? Three or four? Ah, right, you got Naughty by Nature. You got Wu Tang. You have Outkast. You have Suicide Boys. Yep. So you got so, one more. Uh, Bone Thugs. Okay. Ooh. All right. All right. Come tell me what you gonna do. <sighs> All righty. <laughs> it is that time. You what? You gonna take that water? Go ahead. You need to smoke something real quick, or you you got this? You go. Uh, I'm gonna smoke after. You gonna smoke it after? You need a shot or something like that? Oh no. You don't drink. Oh, fam. All righty. Well. Ladies and gentlemen, here for round two to shut it down, V1, the only Lipsy. Let's get to this work, baby. Yeah, yeah. 
for everybody listening. I'm just going to let it, you know, I'm going to let the scratches go. Just enjoy that MF Doom production real quick. Mm. Yeah. Hit the mic like Tyson in a prime fight. Multicolor vision, I'm just trying to find the limelight. I rhyme tight, got way better with hindsight. God mode active, every hit's a divine right. Move freely like politicians on TV, cruising down the street slow like I'm rocking a pair of Heelys. Been on the grind, hustling, pushing a couple CDs. Can hear me on the avenue, even if you don't see me, cause I do this. Don't ask me if I do that. Ain't fucking with the drill shit. Better with the boom bap, ain't fucking with the snake shit. Guessing that you knew that. You ain't the next Machiavelli, boy, your bars are two cap. Really ain't no biggie in the city. Bad boy, no ditty. What's beef? I'm on that potty and bullshit. We litty. Y'all be rapping like you spitting off a of GPT while I'm writing masterpieces off a of GDP. Been ascending, I'm high up in the ozone Feel like E.T., I'm in space, chilling with no phone No contact like COVID, I'm so known No cognac, that jack me, I'm so grown I've been jumping off the rip, watching everybody slip Coming straight for their throats with that kung fu grip Swashbuckling beat record, this my ship Wish your gang president, CEO, this my shit Yeah, killing mics like I'm Dama Lyrical Boston bomber, terrorizing tracks like Osama I've been a motherfucking menace since I came out my mama I'm bringing change to the city, emulating Obama They ain't no drama can get the point across like Christ So precise, I've been aiming for the top It's in my sights I remember writing rhymes and seeing days turn into nights And then the nights turn into days Until my vision wasn't right Like damn, we going in Like when the fuck we ever gonna win I've been going hard for my city And here's a big shout out if you've been fucking with me and now we back at it like crack addicts with bad habits I've been working on the low just to heighten my tax brackets Y'all been wheezing on the beat, chest clutching like asthmatics You know libs equals MC squared, mathematics All the artists in my city, type of people you can't afford When we get together, it's like we building the Megazord Getting bored of all of these rap critics who never poured Blood, sweat, and tears into music for no reward Yeah, real talk from the gutter I'm just trying to make a billy for my wifey and my mother The baby just came, so now I gotta feed another Elevating every day, man, I don't see me going under I got friends and haters, but there really ain't a difference Can tell by all their posts that they've been harboring some ignorance You fruity talking sour, we can tell just by your bitterness Yeah, you got some money, what the fuck is your significance? Yeah, you know I'm ready to rumble, I've been around a long time I've seen a lot of you crumble and you still doing the same shit Ain't none of you humble, so get your ass up out of here Cause over here we don't fumble Hey, lipstick Okay. You hear that Machiavelli line? Y'all are two cap. That's that's Pac spelled backwards. You guys know that, right? Y'all know that, right? I was impressed. I was impressed. How'd you like that, Leticia? That was good. That was good. That was good. I like it better than your last. Yeah, you and me both. Yes, definitely <laughs> like it better than your last. Dope. Um, yeah. Appreciate it. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. What'd you think of a franchise? He killed it. I had to shut up, remember? As soon as he said the Mark of other line, I was like, I you did, you did, you did, you did. I had to shut up, I had to shut up. <laughs> nah, it's way better than first. Um, family, out of respect, anything you want to say we didn't get to ask you? Um, I do have, uh, like I said, I was uh, working on the next album. I'll, uh, I was going to reveal it at the show, mm-hmm. but I feel like this is a nice little opportunity to reveal it here. Why not? Family? Um. It's a Dr. Doom theme album. That's why I chose Doomsday from MF Doom for the beat to rap on. Uh, the name of the album is uh, the album formerly known as Doom. And each song, like most of the songs have uh, little snippets of like, you know, Dr. Doom from the cartoons and shit like that. You know what mm. I mean? Or like maybe from something from the game. So you're going to have a picture of Robert Downey Jr. on your album cover? Because <laughs> you actually, know he's playing Dr. Doom now. No, I know. Actually, funny enough, I had this whole idea, the whole theme. Literally like a week or two. You can even ask my buddy. <laughs> I had like a week or two before that got announced. But the, but a uh, little side note: the cool thing is, I used that announcement as the intro. That's fine. The there album. you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. Um, Audi family. Best way to find you on all those platforms. Uh, you can just find me uh, Libsy official on uh, Instagram. Uh, just type in Libsy into Google realistically, and I'm gonna pop the fuck up. That's the coolest part. Um, Spotify, Libsy, you know what I mean? I have the new album coming out in October. Um, make sure you show up to the uh, Washington Club. I'll, you know, uh, in the comments of this video, I'll, you know, provide a link to get the tickets and whatnot. So uh, make sure you show up to the Washington Club uh, September 13th in New Bedford, Massachusetts, because that shit's going to be a bop, I'm telling you. 
I'm, all right, I'm gonna let you slide. I'm gonna, give, I'm gonna give you an easy one today because everything that goes up online, once it's up there, sometimes it stays there. So that little youngin' of yours that's only, what, nine months old right now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is gonna see this in about five or six years, seven years with it. Look at your dad. So what do you wanna say? What's her name? Uh, Lilith. What do you uh-huh. wanna say to Lilith when she sees this with her friends when she's about seven or eight years old? Uh, Just remind your... Uh just remind your uh, friends that are watching this with you right now <laughs> that their that your daddy can rap better than their daddy. <laughs> <laughs> you hear that, Lily? <laughs> and there it is, ladies and gentlemen, the one, the only Libsy here. Good ish, fam.